Hi everybody, welcome to my vlog. I decided to theme my vlog around how love is expressed in childhood or understood in childhood since tomorrow is Valentine's Day and we have our Valentine's Day picnics coming up. So today in the Lange class we had a lovely session where we discussed what love was to us and a lot of the answers, Lumuka says love is in your heart, Jonah says love is my mom and my dad and puppies. Um, and Jumani says that love is the feeling I have for Amma, Mama, and Kiman. And what we can see from these answers is that a lot of the children understand love in terms of an emotion that they feel towards a loved one, a parent, a sibling, an animal, and that they also understand love in terms of the emotions that, that their loved ones show to them. And I was reading an article by Psychology Today, I'll attach the link to one of the comments in this vlog, speaks about how this is a common response for children who are in age groups of around two or three. That often um, the description of an emotion is how the emotion makes them feel, or it is a description that relates to the connection that they have with somebody. And in keeping with our children's explanations of love, this article that I've mentioned says that as children grow or develop, they go from a more externally focused conceptual line of thinking to one that is more internally based. Originally, children begin centering their concepts around objects or events. For example, a memory about puppies may therefore be the link to why Jonah said that puppies um, are love. And what's interesting about this is what we often see is that as children get older, instead of defining an emotion around an, um, a memory of a feeling or, or a more conceptual idea, they begin to define emotions in terms of how these emotions are demonstrated. So in this article, one of the children who is five or six, who they asked about love says that how uh, love is helping one another love is showing kindness to one another and we can see that as children mature into that age group of around um, five or six they begin to see how certain people express their emotions and so i think the conclusion um, that i'm trying to come to with my vlog or that i drew from the article is that not only as adults we should not only be focusing on expressing our emotions to our children, showering our children with love, showing them they are, that they are supportive.